Alright, this is Lowlands. Welcome to Monster Hunter World. Let's get started. Uh, we're just going to jump right on into it. Uh, start game, and we're going to create a new character, so not either one of my previous made characters here. So begin new adventure. So the beginning is a bit extended. So I will probably try to do what I can to, to explain during the lengthier bits of it. Sisters and brothers of the Fifth Fleet, it's time. I'll keep my farewell brief. Never was much with words. Once you board this ship, there's no turning back. The next ground your feet will touch will be that of the new world. If any of you have lost your nerve, then step away now and let no one judge you. Very well. Then sail safe and strong, and may the Sapphire Star light your way. Alrighty. New world by the horns? I don't know about you, but it feels like ages since I left home to join the commission. So, nervous? Believe you me, I get it. Anything could happen to us, but hey, that's yep. happened. Uh. Hey, aren't you one of the A list hunters? What? No way! So are we! Hey, tell us your name! Alright, now we get to get into the character creation. Alright. So I'm just going to go with a, a male. Uh, we'll go through presets and kind of see what goes for us. Uh, I kind of like this look. We'll go with this one. Confirm. I apparently have a new hairstyle that I had unlocked from playing the game previously. A couple of them, actually. So, default armor, we'll go ahead and stick with leather. Why not? Confirm. Enter name. I'll go with my gamer tag here, Lowlands. Yes, this name is okay. Alright, and now we can do a Palico, which is our little kitty companion to help us on our our quest. Um, you know what? I kinda like kinda like this one. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go with this one. This one's pretty cool too. So make sure we're on that, go with confirm. Alright, enter Palico's name. Uh, I'm going to use uh, a cat that uh, I used to have as a kid. Nimki. Yes, that is okay. And we are all set to start the game.
So, how about a toast? <laughs> to the A-list! And the commission! Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> so, tell me, what's your theory? The Elder Dragons must migrate to the New World for some reason. <sighs> After running the research commission for 40-odd years, the guild's itching for an answer. They say the Fifth Fleet's got the best shot at crack in this case, and I agree! Keep it down. Hey, speaking of, A-listers usually operate in teams of two. Have you sat down with your partner yet? <laughs> Listen to that. <sighs> Getting rough out there. The waves are picking up. That's gotta mean landfall. <laughs> You're on the A-list, right? Huh, meow do <laughs> I'm not psychic, but I do have pretty good ears. Ah, put her there. I happen to be an A-lister myself. Oh, whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Lots of commotion. Well, that's not something you see every day. Oh, not the kitty. I think that might leave a mark. Alright, this is what happens when you try to sell truck. Anybody there? Run up to the wall, start climbing. Get up there. Oh, hey, it's you! Look what happened to the ship! <sighs> we have to do something! It's not safe here! This way! On the bright side, we don't have to move the ship anymore.
a pretty good shot. That's not something you see every day. See, this is why they revoked my flying license. See where we're at. Looks like we're right around here. The Research Commission's base of operations is here. This is where our ship was supposed to dock. For now, I think it would be best if we make our way to base. Yep, don't quite seem like we made it that far, did we? <laughs> I'm kind of wondering if I can kind of expedite this a little bit. Um, normally, she goes off and does her own thing, kind of explores, goes, ooh, pretty. I'm going to see if running straight to where I have to go is going to cause her to pretty much show up on me. See if I can just proc the cutscene. We'll be back here later, don't worry. So we'll have plenty of According opportunity to, 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 HQ, we need to... Hmm. We'll, we'll be I able to come back here and explore everything. Earlier. If you lose sight of me, just follow the scout flies, and they'll lead you right to me. Alright, looks like we were able to kind of accelerate her a little bit and get in over here. This is just showing you a mechanic that lets you hide from monsters, and they'll kind of ignore you, which honestly makes no sense, because most of them probably seen me go into the bush. Uh, I don't okay, often use this unless it's Let's absolutely necessary, which is usually when I just I need to heal, hmm. or I'm trying to do something else and a big monster got in the way. Again, let's see if we can't expect this. We're just going to leap right off the cliff. Because, you know, why right, take the easy way? Alright. Get this, because 
jump point that out. <laughs> Uh, looks like I gotta wait for. Her. What is this track? There's more over there. Let's check it out. take off down the thing he follows them and I guess I gotta follow it move that is not good well Get over here. that escalated quickly there is no way around them he was literally have to go through this cutscene of trying to not get smashed by stomping feet and a flailing body. Jump! Hey. You all right? Let's go. Okay. Now, Monster Hunter World and well, Monster Hunter games in general, uh, there's a, a generous amount of grinding you have to do to upgrade your weapons and get weapon parts and, and that. And I'll do my best to do most of that grinding off camera. So you guys aren't watching me literally grind away at trying to get a specific weapon Amazing, or ain't it? armor parts Just that I want. Gate. It's like nature meant for us to build a stair right here. Astera, I like it. <laughs> the rest of the fifth are already here. You're the last to arrive. Okay, Hesitate. set him oh, down here. Take a nice. Leave the tape up your shoulder. Hold still for a bit. Hey, you guys made it. Be right back. You're alive. Had a rough, huh? When we couldn't find you two, we were starting to sweat bullets. You scared us. We were talking about going out to look for you. <laughs> All's well that ends well. Hey, we need a hand. Sorry. Hey, Come on. We need a hand. Catch you later. <laughs> This here is our trade yard. I guess the name says it all. Look at all the people. The stuff. Incredible. Right? <laughs> We've got it all here. We've got hunters to do all the exploring. Scholars to do the research. Technicians to keep them going. This place is the beating heart of the commission. Wait here a second. Commander, I found him. Welcome to Astera. Welcome to Astera. I'm glad you made it. Somehow I knew you would, though. When you've been in command as long as I have, you start to learn who's capable and who isn't. Now, as much as I'd like to get you up to speed, I'm being pulled in about eight directions at once. 
We'll cover the important matters at Council, which I'll be convening once things settle down. I expect you two to be there, of course. Your reputations precede you. The Guild spoke highly of you as individuals. Think of what you can do as a team. And before I forget, your furry friend was looking for you, poor thing washed up, not too long ago. Go ahead and have a look around Astera. A horn will sound when it's time for council. Well, off you go. So we'll do a we'll brief pretty okay. much... I'll give you the grand tour. Grand tour, and... Let's start by looking for your palico. This is our stockpile. They carry most of the basic necessities. You should drop by later to see what they have. Now, we will be spending an awful lot of time in... Oh, my controller decided to mess up. Give me just a sec to fix this. Next is the smithy. It's this way. Yep, well, I'll join as soon as I am able, buddy. Uh, occasionally, my controller is going to re uh, disconnect itself. Uh, it's been an ongoing issue. I have not been able to get a new controller yet. So, uh, please bear with me as I, I work on getting that settled. Hmm. the commission's fifth fleet right the old man in charge my grandfather was with the first that was a long time ago me I'm not with any fleet born and bred right here never even been to the old world uh, the three main sections that they're gonna take us to the trade yard the smithy here and then the next area we're gonna be spending lots of time there here's our smithy this is where you can craft weapons and armor. You'll be here a lot. Wow! Look at this place. Wanna check it out? Ooh, it's toasty in here. Wanna get going? The canteen? I am so there. And I'm just kind of trying to expedite these guys along, mm -hmm. uh, mostly for the sake of time. Over here. Well, this here is our canteen. Hmm. Hey, over there. the sound for council right they're calling for a council come on yeah now that you are all here let us begin council after tracking a migrating elder dragon across the sea the fifth fleet have finally arrived in Astera. give them a warm welcome they're a fine group worthy comrades who will help see the research commission's long efforts finally rewarded would you like to say a few words thank you sir we're ready to roll up our sleeves and get our hands dirty this here is the Commission's core team you should all get to know each other looking forward to it now down to business the latest monster to make the Elder Crossing is known as Zora Magdaros a huge monster with a mountain of fire upon its back the Research Commission's job is to discover exactly why the Elder Dragons are migrating to the New World. Elder Dragons have been with us since the dawn of time. Altering the ecosystem, reshaping the land, leaving disaster in their wake. Once every decade or so, they flock to this continent. But for what reason? With the Fifth's help, we will find the missing link. Here, here. Now we're talking! Hunters, for the time being, I need you to focus on investigating our Jagras problem and securing Astera. Start by investigating the Jagras' habitat. Find out what makes him tick, and we'll go from there. Right. We're on it, sir. Everyone else, you know the drill. Make sure these hunters have everything they need. Now we're talking! 
You two, make it a priority to learn how we do things around here. You'll find good teachers, so don't be afraid to ask. You heard him. Stick with me and you'll have no problems. The Fifth Banner promises a change in the wind. It's your job to fulfill that promise. All right, dismissed. All right. Mm -hmm. Not even here a whole day and already got your first mission. You really are ready to get your hands dirty. Well, let's go look into this Jagger's problem, but you'll need a weapon first. Over here. There's a box full of equipment you can use in your quarters. Come on, I'll show you the way. Don't really need his help, I kind of already know where to go. That in the big red circle pointing me at the doorway helps too. We've placed some basic gear for you in that equipment box. Make sure to choose a weapon that suits you. Alright. I already kind of know what weapon I'd like to use, so I'm going to go ahead and put it on. Uh, but we'll go ahead and read the tutorials here. Different weapons offer different combat experiences. Great swords hit with devastating force, while the sword and shield allow for quick, mobile flurries. The heavy bowgun, while unwieldy, fires powerful blast, and so on. Choose any one weapon and take it to the field. You can visit the training area after equipping a weapon by speaking to the housekeeper in your room. There, you can practice with your chosen weapon as much as you'd like. Armor. Your five-piece protection. Armor sets are comprised of five pieces. Each piece offers some amount of defense plus equipment skills to aid you in your hunts. You can mix and match pieces however you like to suit your playstyle. Use left trigger, right trigger to view your gear stats and skills. You can save equipment loadouts to quickly switch to your favorite gear combinations. Which we'll mainly be using to match well with our skills. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and use just the leather, but I'm going to use a... Let's see... I think I'm going to go ahead and just stick to uh, my usual starting weapon, which is a Buster Sword, uh, which is the Great Swords. A lot of their attacks are timing based. Um, so if I, if I hit the menu button, I'll get a look of my current loadout and be able to register my loadout. Just by tapping the Y button and saying yes, and the loadout, my current loadout with all of my gear there. Right now, it's not really an issue because we'll be changing our gear quite frequently. Want to get going? All right, so we can choose to talk and go Let's to the training to area, the I'll be there but we're just going to go ahead and leave. You can get more familiar with your weapons at the training area. Yep, nope, we know that. We know we can get familiar with our weapon. Now, I'm familiar with most weapons. The hunting horn. And the Lance, I think, are the two that I don't really know the best. <laughs> Alright. Now that you have access to the armory and provision stockpile, grab what you need. Once you're done, go meet up with your handler in the canteen to sign up for a quest. Alright. Sort through the research commission's leads. And the ones they deem worth I don't really need quests. to grab anything hey! from Over here the provisioner right now. Uh, right now my item box can hold off and we're just gonna run up the lift to the canteen. Alright. So I'm gonna call it an episode there. This seems like a pretty good stopping point. We will continue our adventure next time in which we will accept the quest that the handler has for us if you're new to the channel please like and subscribe and if you also new check out my Skyrim playthrough which is also on my channel and as always thank you for watching 
you guys have a good day.